I don't know, but yeah, we are gonna have to leave here. And, I mean, it kind of sucks, though, because we were doing good with the three-star missions, but it looks like we're gonna have to pause them for a little bit, just until we level up a little bit more. Hello, everybody. Nutta27 here. Welcome back to Starfield. And we need to go deliver our tree branch to Kelton, because he's been waiting a very, very long time. Where is he? Here he is, over in Alpha Centurion. So, yeah, we're going back to New Atlantis. We'll give him the tree branch, and then I guess if this is, like, the end of his quest line... I guess we can find something else to do. Uh, yeah, there is a lot of stuff to do in this city. So, yeah, we'll see what's there. All right, Kelton, I'm finally back. Got a little sidetracked, but, you know, I'm here. The city has what they need. Have you paid a visit to Miss Castler in Aquila City? Um, she wants it back when you're done with it. Yes, yes, of course. I'll see that it is returned to her in one piece. Well, perhaps minus a few shavings. Now... I just need a moment to analyze this and synthesize an audio response to our friend here. All right, so we'll feed in a sample. And now the program will incorporate the genetic and chemical makeup of the sample, extrapolating the size and structure of the original tree. This was put together rather hastily, so complete accuracy is impossible. But I'm hoping it's enough. And there it is. Best hope for a positive solution to this mess. All right, so I guess he did it then. So, we now have a simulated response to our tree. All that's left is to play it. Uh, I don't know much of a singing voice, but I can try. Yeah, how, how do we play this? An excellent question. I have been wondering myself. Oh, you don't even know. I've been forced to listen to this SSNN kiosk chatter incessantly this entire time. I think it could be put to better use. We don't have time to go through the proper channels, but if you can find a terminal and get this uploaded into their system, it might do the trick. All right, I'll do it. I have no doubt that you will. Kelton's audio file added. All right, so we got to go to an SSNN terminal. Is this, like, legal to do? Like, go into their, like, broadcast system thing? I got to head down here. Okay, so I guess we're going to a different part of the city. And this might get me in trouble with some people, but oh well. We'll deal with that after. So where where are we going? Uh, commercial district. Location discovered. Have I never been to the commercial district? Really? Wow. I, okay. I thought I'd been everywhere in this city. I guess not. Oh, look at that. I need to get somewhere up here. Let's boost over. Good enough. You can't go in. David's my friend. He writes me. It's a fangirl. I hate to break it to you, but his PA is the one who signs all those cards and headshots. Mr. Barron's a very busy and important man. But I came all this way. Uh, listen, I might be able to hook you up with some merchants. Maybe get you a ticket to a speaking gig he's got. That's all I can do. You are the best! Welcome to SSNN. Can we talk to this fangirl? I can't believe I'm here. S S N N. Okay, well you just geek out then. We're close to the action. Uh, this is the Baron guy. On the big stories that affect the United Colony. I talk to you about anything. If you ever find yourself with a hot lead, we will do our best to protect your anonymity. Okay. All right, so let's upload this. Am I am I allowed? Like, do I need to be sneaking? It doesn't say. Okay, broadcast diagnostics. Uh, it's upload diagnostic file. All right, and then run a diagnostic. Turn to the tree. All right, so I guess we did it then. I guess it's all uploaded. And no one seems to be mad at me. So, all right, let's head back then. All right, we got to talk to Kelton. I'm already seeing reductions in the strength of the vibrations. The tree is calming down. I can hardly believe that worked. All right, what happens now? I don't know. We've been in uncharted territory this whole time. That doesn't stop now. With the immediate crisis hopefully over, I can slow down and review everything we've learned. And 
Certainly, I'll be keeping a much closer eye on our friend going forward. And you, you have saved this tree and advanced our scientific knowledge of our environment. Noble work across the board. You have my gratitude and that of every citizen in New Atlantis. Though they don't know it. Alright, got some credits, some XP, and the mission is complete. Alright, so. Now what? Um, I'm not doing that mission. Let's see what other missions I have. Uh, what is this one? I, th I don't think I'm able to do this one yet. Loose ends. We could do loose ends. Back to the grind. Oh, yeah, job advertisement. We could go get a job. Or we have all this stuff. We do the main quest, which I totally forgot about. And then we have some activities to do. Also. Okay. I can't. Let's, let's get a job. Because why not? We need money. Let's apply for a job. Where is that? Is that close? Does not seem to be close. Alright, this is where we apply. Are you working toward that next technological leap? Then let Ryujin Industries help you get there. Ryujin Industries? So what, what would I be doing for these people? Uh, about us? Our mission statement to deliver the best quality, life-improving technology today before you need it tomorrow. Ryujin Industries has been a leader in technology since its creation. Strive toward advancement. Believe there's always room for improvement. Fulfilling customer desires is our number one goal. Okay, cool. Uh, let's get a job application. Welcome to Reusion Industry job application. All questions must be answered in order for your application to be submitted. Work experience. How many years of experience do you have working in a secret secretarial position or corporate environment? Um, none. How familiar are you with Reusion Industries and its product line? Um, not at all. What is your proficiency with computers in regards to typing and file management? Uh... I don't know, medium, I guess. What level of education have you completed? High school. You have history of criminal activity. Um, I don't know, have I done anything criminal in this game? Have I been caught doing anything criminal in this game? That's the real question. I'm going to say no. Your application is now complete. To officially submit your application, please select to update. Okay, submit application below. Answers may no longer be changed. All right. Cool. Thank you for submitting your application. Please report to Imogene Sal's on the operations for Region Tower in Neon for your interview. All right, so we gotta head to Neon. Fill out an application today to become cool. Part of All right, then let's head over there, and we'll see if we can get ourselves a job. All right, tenure interview at Ryujin Tower. That is just this way. So I guess in this where they operate out of. Oh yeah, Ryujin Apartments. Okay. Might need to shop at one of these places. I gotta buy more med packs. I know that. What how many? I only have three. Am I allowed to go in then? No one's gonna stop me. Are you? No one really. They, they don't even know why I'm coming here. Nobody stopped me. I could have just been like, carrying a bomb. I have grenades on me. No one cared. You gotta love that. Are you, are you who I'm talking to? Oh, you are. I think you are. Oh, optional. Okay, we can check in. Let's check in. You must be one of the candidates that Imogene Salzo is interviewing today. Her office is down the hallway to my left. Take another left at the conference room. Follow it around to the right and up a small flight of stairs. Then a take left, a left, or right, upstairs. That way until you see her office. Sounds like a maze, right? So if you want me to walk you back there or have any questions, just let me know. Um, I can find the office myself. Great. Probably. Well, good luck then. I'm sure I'll see you on your way out. All right. So it was a left, a right, some stairs, another left, I think. So a left, a right. Oh, and then these stairs, and then a left. The heck is that? Whoa. Security mini bot. Oh, that's security. Okay, there's probably a turret in there. Great. A full spacesuit. Corporate environments aren't that toxic. Well, I don't want to take it off. It's my armor. Take a seat. All right, I'm ready. I've, I've never done a job interview before. I don't know what I'm doing, but I feel confident. All right. Just to get a few things straight here, I'm Imogen Salzo, senior operations specialist here at Ryujin Industries. I don't normally do this, but my counterpart Yuko is indisposed at the moment, so here I am. We're looking for someone to fill an entry-level administrative position. 
Apparently, our algorithm has failed us and believes you to be a decent match. Which I'll take up with our technicians later. So, let's get this over with. Why do you want to work for Ryujin Industries? Money. Why are you doing Neon Street, Rad? I grew up in the shadow of Ryujin Tower, so it's time to see the place is all about. That sounds like a good answer. It's always nice to see the local residents take an interest in us. This next one should be interesting, considering you marked having zero experience. You're welcome. Why do you consider yourself qualified for a job like this? Um, I want money. Or persuasion, I can make any deal happen. Including this job? The art of the deal can go a long way here. Now, I'm getting pretty good at persuasion what here. What you say is true. You'll have department heads fighting over you in no time. How motivated are you to succeed? Uh, I'm going above and beyond to get the job done. It depends on what I'm working toward. Just hoping to not get fired. Now, that is true. But they probably don't want to hear that at a job interview. So, we'll say I'll go above and beyond. All in, huh? At least that's an attitude we can work with here. And finally, my last question. If you worked here for five years, what role would you see yourself in? I don't know. I don't even fully know what job I'm trying to get. I'll be running the company. I have a role in management, research and development, cybersecurity. I doubt I'll make it five months. Um, yeah, I'll be running the company. Full disclosure, it's all about making deals with the right people around I wonder here. if I can run this company. You put those skills of yours to good use and choose the right sides. You probably won't be running the place, but you'll be right next to the one who does. Good enough. So look, since there's a million other things I'd rather be doing than this, not to mention that this isn't even my job, you're hired. I did it. On a probationary period? Of course. Good enough. First order. There's a meeting starting soon, and I need you to pick up the coffee order at Terra Brew. Fairly easy, so you shouldn't be able to screw it up. If there's a line, skip it. Tell them you're here for Imogene Salzo, and you should get served right away. Pick up coffee at Terra Brew. Come I've just got to go on a coffee run. Oh god, you scared me. Make it quick. I have a deadline. You talking to me? I, I, I'm just on a coffee run, man. Alright, well, I mean, I guess it's better than nothing, you know? Maybe we'll get paid for this. Probably not. Okay, there's a, there's a shop I want to look at here. Some goods. Do you sell any med packs? Oh, there's med packs right back there. If you're looking for any specific goods. Rosa and I guarantee we'll beat Sieghart's lousy selection every time. Uh, I'm telling you a problem with Sieghart's place. Uh, all right, yeah, do you? Oh, I don't have a problem with his place. My problem is Sieghart himself. That man has absolutely no respect for the business community on Neon. He skips merchant meetings and refuses to participate in any of our group buys. Worst of all, he pays off Neon security to keep his place safe. Uh, keep his place safe sounds like smart business to me. It does. Um, maybe you should just mind your own business. Yeah. Um, I mean, it sounds like he's being smart, though. Yeah, sure. If all you care about is yourself. Well, I kind Every of do. Every secret makes validates Neon security's corruption. He's setting a bad precedent that many merchants are forced to follow. Anyway, sorry. I know I can get a little intense about these things. If you'll forgive the outburst and have a look around, I'm sure you'll find something you might want to buy. Well, I know what I want to buy. No problem. I'm sure you'll find something you like. Alright, uh, is there any ammo I need? Um, I could buy more laser ammo. Oh, you should told me how much I had. I just buy it all. Um, oh, I, I do use this, right? I think. I'm trying to remember what ammo I use, and I, I tend to forget. I feel like I use 6. Do I use 6.55? Uh, what gun uses that if I do? Oh, here we go, 6.5. Okay, that's my rifle. Okay, eh, I might buy some of that. How much ammo do I have for your 158? Alright, maybe I'll buy some of the 6.5. And then is there anything else? I might want 50 caliber rounds. Could probably get those. And 7.5 if he has them. Do you have those, sir? Let's see. Um, no. No 7.5? Dang it. Alright, get this then. That was actually kind of expensive. Whoopsies. 
All right, how many med packs do you have? Please have some. You only have one med pack? Are you and it's 525. Let's buy it. How is that all you had? Unbelievable. All right. Um, oh, I can go talk to Seagirt. Oh. Okay. Yeah. That would be extremely helpful. I honestly don't know what to say. Um, you can say thank you. Yes, of course. On behalf of Rosa and I, thank you. Just be careful when you're dealing with Seagirt. You can be surprisingly unreasonable when he's cornered. All right. Well, we're not going to do that right now because we still have to do a coffee Tell to run. Tell you know about our store. Are you telling me if I look in that right there, there's not going to be a med pack? I don't think they even know oh, I guess not. I can't check. What's in that one? Oh, there it is. You're holding out on me there. That's not going to happen. Alright, well, let's keep on going on our coffee run then. We are almost there. Is there anywhere else that would like sell med pack? Oh, medical. Hold on. Here we go. Do, okay. Alright, let me go in here. I, sh I just need to buy more med packs. Do you sell this stuff? Nature of your medical emergency. Uh, I don't really have a medical emergency. Oh my goodness. Another poor soul. Alright. Tell me what happened to you. Is it an Aurora overdose? Something else perhaps? Um. You gotta purchase some medical supplies. Oh, you're certainly welcome to take a look, but I'm afraid we're dangerously low on supplies. Uh, that's unusual. I can assure you it isn't by choice. You see, I'm a bit at odds with the current administrator of Neon. His drug is turning the streets into a graveyard, and he doesn't seem to care. We've argued about it on more than one occasion, and all he's done is try to persuade me to quit. Thinning out my supply chain is his newest tactic. Uh, obviously, there's a stranglehold on this entire city. Yeah, he does. Then you understand what I'm up against. At this point, I've resorted to asking anyone that has a ship registered outside of the Boli system to bring me medical supplies. I pay them for the supplies, of course, but it's the only way I can sneak them past Bayou's people at the spaceport. Now, if there's anything else I can do for you, anything at all, you just let me know. Uh, do you have anything for sale? I have a few items left, I think. All right, anything that I need. Oh, nine? Oh, I want them all. Can I afford them all? I can? Oh, nice. Give me them. Cool. I am going broke, but whatever. Um, I can help him. That would be amazingly helpful. It's a relief to meet someone who gives a damn about anyone other than themselves for a change. Oh. And I'll pay you directly for the supplies, of course. It's the only way I can sneak them past Bayou's people at the spaceport. Uh, I hope you won't get in trouble for this. Don't worry about me. You just watch yourself. Administrator Bayou doesn't like people that rock the boat, if you catch my meaning. Anyway, I have a contact over at the clinic in the Narian system. Abby Edding? She's one of the nurses there. She'll get you started. Thank you so much for doing this. You have no idea how helpful it'll be for the poor folk that live in Ebside. Alright, well, we are getting a bunch of new missions. Remember your life. I will remember you people. You were very helpful to me. I got nine med packs, so... How many do I have now? Like, 15? About? Somewhere around there, maybe? Okay, we have 13 med packs, which is good. Frank Renix all in a twist because his robot got vandalized. We had a good laugh about it back at the station. <laughs> okay. Is that a mission? Oh, it was. Talk to Frank Rennick. All right. So, we got a ton of new stuff, which is awesome. We didn't get to go on our coffee run because we're currently out of time for the video. That's all right. So, next video, we'll go on our coffee run. We'll keep doing stuff for Ryujin. And then, I mean, I will see how far that goes. And then, maybe we'll do one of the other quests we got. Don't know yet. But, yeah. That is going to be the end of this one. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you next time.